So, um, now we're coming to the cool down. Again, I think it's the most important part because uh, if you're getting older, it is more important to stay lean, you know, and soft uh, rather than be like, you know, muscle packed and, and too strong. Uh, so, I start my um, cool down on the ground because I'm already here. Legs straight, put the knees together and we take one leg uh, under the knees and press your knee to your breast. And take care that this one is straight, this one is loose and you just press it. Breathe out and count till eight or longer. Whatever. Seven, eight. If you are with eight, you just um, stretch your heel so that the feet goes up to your knee and you take your ankle opening up and also press down, pull your um, knee to your chest and just keep that. You will feel a stretch here. There we go. Eight here. Okay, you see, look to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now your hand is going up, your head too, and then you lift it back up and you lay it like this. And you will feel much more intense right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, something to do here, no? Okay. So we are back in the standing position and um, the only thing uh, we have to stretch is the front muscles here. You know, I, the thing is I knew all these terms for these muscles, but it's not important. It's really just important that you do it, that you be gentle to yourself. And um, that's the most thing. So what we do is we stretch like this, you know, very important. Let the knees together. Keep them together and if you um, have the idea you don't get much of a stretch, what you can do is press your hips to the front, you know, see this? This is how you can see that, tuck, tuck. very little movement. Keep this for two times, again on the other side, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, twelve. Okay, and the last thing I do is the shoulders. Everybody knows this one. Be careful that you don't put your arm on the elbow. It's always a buff or here, but you know, if you are very tense, maybe this one, but you know this here. Okay, well, we do this, counting till 12. This one has to be loose, you know, keep your hands loose, everything's loose. The stretch is in the shoulder, you know, and you stay straight. Keep your legs loose. Second one is this one here. Also, don't have any tension because we're stretching. And for the shoulders, you get on this here. This is a nice stretch too, easy to do. Just lift up your chin and press with your arm. Other side. And you do this like, you know, always 12 counts, easily, very relaxed you know after you were running and you did the groundwork you know you know bringing your body down metabolism goes back to normal muscles go stretched and go back into normal length you know so this at 12 1 2 3 4 11, 12 okay yeah. you um roll your head over your chest for 12 times And you can start like doing breathing. Like, dun, dun. So the neck at the end, I use this one here. I think it's very good to do and you cannot go wrong. What you do is you take your hand and you lay your hand on the ear and automatically with the weight of the arm, you stretch your neck. You know, be very nice and gentle to yourself. And as soon as you feel it's getting like too much stretch, it's like mostly after 10 counts or so, 8, 10 counts, you just resolve it. Other 
away. Okay. The last one is um, to relax, you just stretch everything and your feet are shoulder wide and a little bit the knees are bent, just a little and you just go and now we do this another time and the last time you stay down and you loosen up I do this very good for your muscles in the face just loosen up and then you see you can try to hang out your back and um, see that your ears between your shoulders that's the most best thing to do that we can Turn this down, hello. <laughs> so uh, yeah, this is what you do. And then you go slowly on the feet, or you can do this. Depends what you like, it's not so much. And then you roll up slowly. I'm going a little bit fast now, but you just roll up. Do this very slow. As slow you do this rolling up, as bad as it is. I, you know, speeding up things a little bit here. Okay, well, this is uh, what I do uh, to stay a little bit in shape, and I call it like maintenance. I don't uh, want to do anything um, harsh anymore. I'm not interested. I'm turning 50 this year, so why would I do that? Um, and um, yeah, if you want to stay in shape, uh, the whole program takes about an hour it's not so long you can also do everything separately so no need to do it all you um, i just would recommend to do something uh, like the warm-up or the stretching part uh, because uh, your muscles in these days just need to be lean and soft to prevent also any injuries in case of you fall or whatever so well this um, yeah it's all to say now it's time for having a breakfast and i wish you a good day and maybe I think I will do another sequence with some extras and special stretching for those that are interested. Have a good day and uh, enjoy.